Hello friends, welcome to lecture number 22 that is integration of the Selenium test to the Jenkins server. In this particular lecture you will learn how to run the Selenium tests created in the Visual Studio on the Jenkins server. I have already installed the Jenkins and this is how the Jenkins server looks like when you access it through the browser. And uh, some important settings that you need to make over here is that by clicking on the manage Jenkins you need to install some plugins. So if you go to manage plugins over there you will notice that I have installed some of the plugins. Like you will need this git plugin and ms build plugin ms test runner plugin. So install those plugins and then also you need to make sure that uh, you need to if you go to manage Jenkins in the configure system make sure that all the paths are given properly like you will have to give the git exe uh, path path of the git application then ms build installations ms test installations all this you will have to give and then click on save and then what you have to do is you have to click on new item and then create the new build configuration so i have already created new build configuration for the visual studio project that is this one so i'm just gonna show you some of the settings important settings like how I have configured that project in here and you will notice that I have given this particular uh, git repository and then provided the credentials of the github account in this version source code management section and in this build section I have given this particular setting execute windows batch, com batch command that build step I have added and I have added three steps over there first step is actually nugget which is used to download all the required nugget packages for the solution this is important step the next step is uh, building the project so to build the project i'm using this particular syntax so you have to give the full path of uh, ms build and then here the solution file name next thing that i have to do is execute the test using ms test so uh, given this ms test over there and test container is given over here so test container is actually specifies uh, in which DLL our tests are there so in this particular DLL our tests will be there so that I have given and this is uh, you can execute tests using this windows batch command step but you can also alternatively execute the like use different steps like build visual studio project or solution using ms build and run unit tests with ms test so you can also do it that way but uh, I'm just gonna use this windows batch command with this this uh, these lines of code and then click on save and after that uh, you can uh, build this project or run this build using this particular by clicking on this particular link and you can view the log by clicking on this link over there as you can see it is downloading that repository and then it is using uh, executing that nugget.exe command then it will build the project as you can see build is successful and then it will start executing the tests from this particular DLL so one test was disabled due to ignore attribute but it will execute uh, remaining steps uh, sorry remaining tests now over here uh, notice that we have started the Jenkins server as a service in Windows that's why you will not see any browser opening over here but tests are executing in the background and as you can see some tests have passed and some have failed so that is how you can execute your selenium test develop in the visual studio on jenkins server that ends our lecture number 22 that is integration of the selenium with jenkins thanks for watching this video